Welcome back to part two. I'm just gonna go straight into the video. I hope you guys enjoy. The North Shore can be a brutal fishery. It can be lights out some days, and then some days you cannot seem to find a fish. And we were presented with some very high water and very cold water. Water didn't touch 40 degrees on any rivers I checked this weekend. And it was just super cold as well, air temps and very sleety the second day. But when dealt with these conditions, we just try to find fishable water and not necessarily where we want to fish, but where we have to fish. And with that, the high water does bring in fresh fish. And we found our lowly little hole on this one little creek, which wasn't my favorite spot to fish, but we found fresh fish this morning. See the ways of this world just bring you to tears. Keep the Lord in your heart and you'll have nothing to fear. Live the best that you can and don't lie and don't steal. Keep your nose on the grindstone. There's a fish. Yeah. I got my nut. Gonna back up a bit. Color right now. <laughs> Fucking. He's just fighting. He's just, they're hot fish right now. He's kind of got nowhere to go, and I got nowhere to go, so it's just kind of a dog fight right now. I'll let you know if I need it, but for now, you just hold on to it. Oh, he could have got him. Right here, right here. There we go. Good that. Gotta relax. Oh. Good that. Look at he's got your fly on him. You yeah, snagged him. That. That's why you broke off. It's a hot fish, but small. Fresh hen here. Beautiful, beautiful fish. I'd say about 23. Maybe. Fresh hen here on the orange egg again. Just came up in the lake probably, maybe yesterday, but a lot brighter fish than some of the ones we were catching yesterday. Beautiful, beautiful fish. Hard fight. Go for the release on her. There's a strong current here. Get her up in there. Yep, there she goes, right back in that hole we caught her. Let's go! Another fish on. Ooh. ooh. But we don't want him to. I'm gonna back away just a little bit. And I might run up. Cause he might get... Chartreuse, baby, chartreuse. I see his tail, but you almost gotta get their head. No, I, yeah. Oh, he's a nice fish. Oof, hot, hot, hot. Oh, he's gonna keep that tension on him. Now this is a fight. One more time. One more time. Right. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna ease back to maybe he'll get less spooked. Then I'll run up on him. Just back up. Just back out of there. Back out of there. God damn it! That was bad. I was fucking done. Hey, hey, that's all that matters. There you go. Nice fish, right after mine. Beautiful kipe on her. Look at that. Go for the release. She's lively, or he's lively. Just let him get in there. Push him, get him a little bit on that lip there, it'll calm down. Look at him. There he goes. Yep, right back into that run. I'll
versions are the same And don't you write a song about it Well, fuck Now we got those two fish out of that hole, and while me and Grant were catching those two, we were having a good time. We also like to show the struggles of steelhead fishing, where my dad here not lost one, but not two, but three pop-offs of fish. And he was still looking to catch his first steelhead, so it was very frustrating for him. But let's just say fourth time was the charm. And then what we were saying is maybe just try to do a little bit more side trips back and forth. And don't reel up any more line than you have right now. Reel, 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 reel. Come on, he's got to reel. Good job. Good job. There you go, Dave. Woo! There you go, Dave. Hell yeah! Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. That's a big head. It's a big head. There you go, Dave. Woo! There you go, Dave. Hell yeah! Let's go. Let's go. That's a bigger oh, one. A big head. Yeah, beautiful. Yep. Look at that. That's great. All right. You can start Perfect. going for the lease. Yep. Yep. Don't worry about my net. Oh, oh fired up. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Yep. And with that fish, it was a storybook way to end our first weekend on the North Shore. My dad's first steel had being cut. I think I was more excited than he was. With that, that wraps up our um, second part of the series. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Remember to subscribe for next part. We get a lot hotter wear and a lot of fish for the next weekend. And remember to like and drop a comment. Let me know what you think. Thank you guys for watching and stay tuned for part three. It should be coming out shortly.